tonight is National Night Out. There's hundreds of events that are occurring throughout our entire, not just city, but our county, and, and likely thousands of events occurring throughout the United States. Again, tonight is National Night Out. It's for families to come out, get outside of your homes, meet your neighbors, meet your police department. It's all about working together to make sure that we have the safest communities for all of us to live in. It used to be gang infested. A lot of gangs used to come here all the time. And so what we did was we got together, City Heights Development Corporation, we all got together and decided that this is going to be a community park for the families, not for the gang members or drug dealers, but for the community. To me, the event is important because it brings the community together. We want the community, the residents, our kids to have a safe and peaceful park. Well, today we want to let the kids know that, you know, we are here as police officers to, to help them out, uh, whatever, whatever you know, help they need, and to know that if uh, they run into any trouble, on the, either on the way to school or on the way home after school, that they need to reach out to us, and we're here to help them out, and you know, as well as the, their parents. What I'd like to think is we're the eyes and ears of, of our community. You know, what I think is if you see something, say something. And the more of us that say something, we'll, we'll, we'll make our community a lot better place to, to live. Nights like these are important because the community really does feel like they're being listened to. Uh, when there's media out here, when they see media trucks, and when they see elected officials, when they see their representatives, they feel like what they did through the last five, six, seven, eight months of planning really does make a difference. Uh, you know, when they see the youth come out here and they're enjoying the resources and they're playing on that rock wall and they're hanging out and they're meeting uh, the police officers, the community relations officers who are assigned to their specific neighborhood, it really makes a huge difference and, and, and that's what it's all about. I've seen a lot more trust with the police department, a lot more collaboration, and we're one of the very few communities that has a police problem solving meeting the first Wednesday of every month at the Mid-City Police Station uh, with the police officers where people in the community can come and talk to the officers and help collaborate with them to solve problems and issues in the community. The, the years I've served as a community activist and community organizer and the several boards that I've served, I can definitely see the change in this neighborhood and the pride that the community has as well. Um, I see more families living here. I see more families staying in the community to attend the schools. Um, and I see, I see growth in small businesses, and I hope that continues. Together we can do it with the police department, with, uh, with uh, the residents, with the surrounding homes, and um, we can do it all together. Not only just for our kids, but for our grandkids in the future.